That awning don't look right at all. Did you not see the tree? You might have broke it. I think I probably broke it. Ooh. Did it? Ah. Uh, yes. Don't let your guard down with Harvey. Cars are gonna be like, okay, there's a man running. What a, what a nut. I sat down right next to a gator. It was like eight feet away from me in the water and it was like hissing at me. You just never know where they are. I didn't know that was a Florida thing. Ooh. You wanna go paddle Hey, that wasn't so bad. We got in there in one shot. That was nice. Nicely done. What are you thinking? Oh, you're measuring. I think, ooh, I think we're gonna risk it here. Wait, I'm hold go. on, how close are we? Look at that. Technically, this says we're gonna hit. I say you risk it for the biscuit. We're gonna just go for it and see if it's No, we're not, are you okay. serious? Yeah, I think it's fine. Hold on, let's take a bet. I bet it's not. Why would I make those markings on that stick if it- You must have overshot. You just think you know me all the time, don't you? You just like know everything about me. I feel me. like the markings are always a little... Plus, look at this. It's flexible. Oh, you could take this off. The only thing... Oh yeah, I'm gonna... Instead of just pulling the truck forward and re-backing in, like we'll just take screws. the whole fender off. Yeah. I'm gonna try to go slow, but these things only have one speed. Yeah, what speed is that? Nay nay speed? It's like in or out. If you, if you hit the button, there's no slowing it down. It just goes. So okay. Just hit, punch really loud if we're gonna hit. Okay. Ooh, all right, here we go. Keep it coming, nice and easy. You're doing good. Oh snap, that's actually pretty close. Oh, I just heard a click. I just heard, we're good, are we out? We always, go, we, I swear we have magnets on each other. When I'm going one way around the trailer, she's always, always going the opposite way. Pushing on this would have been no How did you do that? You I'm knew just, it was. I'm magical. Chuck said men over measure sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> we just give it a little Isn't extra. That, like, the whole trick? Just a little mm -hmm. something something. Yeah. You want your moment, your photo here next to it, you can give a thumbs up. Okay, that's that's enough of that. <laughs> we are so done with that attitude, sister. We are back. We are back at Anastasia State Park. We were here a couple days and then had to go and stay on someone's private property that we knew because we had uh, no reservations for Memorial Day weekend. Yay, Hanks! I sat down right next to a gator. It was like eight feet away from me in the water and it was like hissing at me. Let's go see if we can get him to hiss again. I feel like I'm gonna be on the next episode of like Stupid and Dead or something like that. Or like the next episode of What Did This Idiot Do? So uh, tune in to that whenever that comes out. So we're back and we are ready for our meetup. We are so excited. Guys, if you wanna be in the loop for meetups and all that fun stuff, you can go to our website, happilyeverhanks.com and you can enter your email at the footer of the page or you can go to the contact us section and sign up and that way you will get weekly updates from us about what's going on. So get on that because we have a lot of people signed up we booked an awesome place. It's gonna be Friday night and it's gonna be hopping. We are so excited. So maybe I should help the hubby get set up some more. So. We just got done filming our how to save money on the road video. While we were trying to film, somebody just had so much to say. Let's go, let's go interview them. We're on in three, two. For all the other cats that need to save on their fancy peas and friskies, what is your advice, sir? Oh, sir? Oh, you have something to say? Oh. Oh, sir? Okay. Oh, God. How do you do it? How do you make this work? How do you afford to eat all the fancy peas that you eat without getting a pound? Cameraman, you have a shot of them. Do you have a shot? We're good, we're good. Get this in there with a the good audio. This is the most intense interview I've ever done. Sir, oh, 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 oh. He's vicious. Oh. He's vicious. What are you? My first day on the job doing this, I'm freaking out. Yeah. Go get him. We're going, we're go, going. Go, 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 go. He's up in the bedroom. I have another 
question! So we are getting ready for our first meetup. St. Augustine, Happily Ever Hanks' first meetup. We are so pumped. Yay! How many people we have coming? Like 20? Like 22 signed up. 22. Yeah. This is incredible. So if you guys are looking for more information on future meetups, because yeah. we have plenty of those planned, yes. we'll throw a link in the description below. You can sign up and we'll give you the first details of whenever we have a place figured out. Yeah, and we'll keep it simple as we make our way through the states. We'll just be like, hey, we're gonna be in this area, in this state at this time. Let's, uh, if you're in the area, let's go to the bar and let's hang out. Where are we right now? We don't know what's going on out there. What are the vibes? Vibe check, we'll let you know about half an hour right and uh so and can i just say real quick how okay. beautiful you look right oh, now thank you you're so sweet and i love you oh, okay <laughs> more campers falling in yeah love it people are out here living life to the fullest. it says we're looking for we're doing uber to the we're being snazzy tonight we're being responsible because we are getting an uber to the bar i'm not i'm dressed in boat shoes right now yeah these shoes won't be able to hold carl's up. getting snazzy today we're getting all snazzy. Snazzy. Up. We're getting snazzied up. If you guys are ready to get snazzy with the Hankstro, hashtag snazzy, snazzy in the comments. Snazzy or snazzy? Snazzy. How do you spell that? I don't know. Wait, snazzy or snazzy? Snazzy. I love what you're doing with that. All right, let me... Uh... That awning don't look right at all. What happened? Did you not see the tree? You thought you had the awning game figured out. You're like, I'm gonna roll them in before bed and let them dry off every once in a while and we're good. You might have broke it. I think I probably broke it. We never had problems until we started filming our journeys and then all of a sudden everything breaks. Let's go see. Holy man. Like, weren't we just saying, like, how happy we were to be here because of all the overhangs of the trees? And then I put out the awning. Even backing in, you and I were like, watch our tail in. We're gonna miss this tree. And still, this morning I wake up and I just put out the awnings. And I'm like, do to do, do. It's a nice little backdrop for you. It's like, RV life. Oh my gosh. Hashtag RV life. Just never I guess, stopped. I guess roll it in. We'll see what happens. No, keep going actually. Yeah, but the... No, it looks like it's doing it. We might, it might not be able to be fixed until we get somewhere where we can extend it all the way. No, it's good. Oh my gosh, it's good. It's good? It just, it was magical. I got it on camera. It just kind of like fixed itself. Don't buy an RV. <laughs> Stop telling people false information. You have one little awning issue when you're freaking out. I mean, replay. Let's see that in slow motion. Yeah, I think it's, I think we're good. Is there normally a gap up there? I think so. I just don't think we ever really noticed. How about uh, Carl just never touches awnings ever again in his entire life. I'm awning now. Are you really an RVer if you never have an awning issue? We've never had an awning issue. So now we're official, like we reached gold status of RVing. I think so. Like the highest tier you can get because we've had an awning issue. I did that. Hey, I can believe it. Yeah, I know you can believe it. There's a gap. <laughs> so we're good. That moment when I was sitting at the computer, think I was feeling good, felt great, smile on my face, I looked up. Kid you not, I just, there's the awning and the awning itself was this one big U shape and I'm like, Huh. And, and you're like, that don't look right. Then I'm like, honey. And you're like, what? <laughs> uh, yeah, that was Word easy the fix. wise, don't let your guard down with RVing. Ah, uh, I just came out to cook some burgers because we're getting hungry. And I realized that Florida is like the only state where it rains and it has the sun out at the same time. 
everyone else is walking around acting normal like this is just normal everyday life let me tell you being from california rain and sun is not normal everyday life cheap eating at its finest we're all about keeping it cheap on the road let me tell you listen whatever fills the belly right am i right or am i not not right i'm thinking you eat cheap now save money stay on the road and then when we meet up with all you guys on the road then we can go out to eat and really enjoy a nice dinner all together and then we don't have to stress about money spending habits and all that jazz saving the most money and living full-time on the road that's what it's about if you want more information we'll throw a link up above check that bad boy out that one's pretty fun all right let's see how this burger is doing oh yeah looking good looking good oh no my cheese is getting wet hon my cheese is getting wet with rain cheese louise oh. <laughs> yes i'm so excited about that one but on a serious note, my cheese is wet. Nene is not happy. You okay up there? What's wrong with you? What? I'm asking what's what's wrong with you. I can't find the emoji. You can't find an emoji? I'm sure everyone's gonna be fine with it. Guys, are you gonna be okay without an emoji today? I found it. I think we're okay. Found you found it. I found it. Everyone can resume their life. Alright. Get that salty attitude under control. I'm gonna miss ya. But with all your spiders and night crawlers that are here, ooh, I am not gonna miss that. What is that? That thing looks like it's legit off Jumanji or something. That thing does not look happy. Not gonna miss that. Not gonna miss that. Let's go sweep this slide off. <laughs> Easy little guy. Easy little guy. Peace out, bro. I'm out. Florida, we're out of here. Okay, so I got a crazy idea. You guys are gonna be like, I don't know how you guys stay married. I was climbing down. I got to thinking after seeing that spider, Nene hates spiders. So I picked up a little twig on the roof. I'm gonna bring it down and I'm gonna see what her reaction is. I like to keep it spicy in the marriage. Don't worry guys, this is a two way road. So these pranks that we pull on each other are mutual. We're both a little sick in the head. I don't know what's wrong with us, but we have fun with it. I'm gonna see if I can get her good. Come with me. Oh wow, look at this, look at this. AC is working hardcore, that's how hot it is. Let's take it, is this gonna work? I don't know. Carl, not cool Carl. Hey hun. What? Oh my gosh, there was the hugest freaking spider up there. The hugest. This <gasps> one. <laughs> Are you okay? Husbands! Oh, come on! Oh, Dude, no, I got video of it, though. You're gonna love it. Oh. Wow, you are sweating. I know, it's I hope hot. everyone didn't have to just watch you, like, sweat these poor people. Of course not. No, all good. Okay. RV life, you don't sweat. It's perfect yeah, temperatures it's all the time. Yes. Like, when yes. you go up and you slide your slides in and out, perfect time of the day. Humidity, not a problem. It's, it's fine. Like, it's great. This summer, everyone's gonna be up there like- Oh yeah. Cool, calm, collective. Cool beers in the hands, lemonades, kids yeah. running around, everyone's like, hey, it's a great time. Yeah. No stress backing no in. Sweating. Come on out guys, RV life is so fantastic. Oh. <laughs> Yes, like it wow. just hit it. So I think like, if yeah. I might have to go up there and just hold it for a second, or I might have to back up and pull it to the side around. That's what I would do. Back up and pull. I'll watch it from here. Right. We'll watch it. I gotta make sure you stay in my mirror. He reminds me whenever he's backing up, I gotta get behind him because we don't have a backup camera. That should be good. All right. I gotta run in this heat. What, what I'll do is I'll do a, a, a wide swing it around, try to miss the ACs. If you still are not clearing it, I'm gonna have to go up and want to go really slow. And... Do you want, you're gonna go to the right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. You know, sometimes you can't just assume because you're at a state park and they accept big rigs that you're gonna clear these branches. Looking good. Looking good. Perfect. You got it. You got it, man. 
watch me like saying he got it and then I, I'm not paying attention and he just rips off that post or something. Uh, Good job. What's that? Good. We cleared it. Yeah. So I guess we kind of have an idea where is low, too low is low. Low is too Yeah. Low. Well, I was saying you can't always low count on low. the, that, I, I can't run just because it has big rigs that the branches aren't going to hit. Yeah. So I wonder if we should tell them like, well, I don't know if they'll address it or not, but. You just want me to get up there with the saw? Get up there with the saw. Yeah. I don't know what your guys' experience, because I'm sure a lot of you've been out there doing it full time or whatever. What has your experience been? If you run into something like this at a state park, do you let the park rangers know about it and they address it? Or is that something they're like, no, nah, we can't really touch it. You got to work around it. Let us know in the comments below, because that's the first time that's ever happened to us. I'm glad we had that time to address it and there wasn't anyone behind us. That was really good. Yeah. Though. Yeah. Oh, now there's someone behind us. Now there's someone. RV life just never starts throwing curveballs at us, right? Right. I love it. That's, Carl and Nene. That's how you keep it fresh. But we rock it out together good. Yeah. You High just, five. yeah, you gotta have a good teammate and it's always a team effort. Always a team I effort. I mean, marriage is just always a team effort. Oh, now you're just getting deep on us? Yeah. I don't, I'm not gonna believe it till I see it. Dumping Hanks with the Hanks. I'm not gonna believe it till I see you let her rip. <laughs> We definitely have more people in the comments saying they're the letter rip type person. Yeah. But, oh, it's over there. I think. Uh, I don't know. It's one way. I don't know. Is that the duck? That is a pet walk area. Never mind. Okay. Like I said. Let's go for a walk to the dump. This is exciting. Dexter. Why don't I just go walk real quick? Okay. You hang out here with all the stuff. It, it might be over there. Sitting in here with the AC and he's out there uh, enjoying that hot, warm, moist weather. Yes, I said it. I said moist. Make me proud, baby. Find that dump. Look at him. That's a man on a mission right there. He's like, where can I let her rip? Just wandering around the rest area. Don't mind us. If that doesn't look suspicious, then I don't know what does. The only problem with him doing this is he might be man looking. Like it might be right there and he's walking past it. So, all right. Well, there goes, there goes the husband, I guess. Dexter and I will figure this out ourselves. Bye! Guys, if you see my husband on all, along Interstate 20, can you please um, return him? I will send you a shipping label with a return. You just have to put your return address. 